It's so loud in here! Hey folks, Gregory Cockery here. It is NAM 2018. It's actually end of day two here. And I gotta tell you, I'm surrounded by a cacophony of fusion mayhem right now. There is a savage gherkin stroke and festival going on right next door. Not that I'm judging, but it's happening. And I'm in the caulk amplifier booth. I had the good fortune of hooking up with the caulk amplifier people. I always loved their amps, knew they were great amps, and I love their name because it's my name. Isn't that crazy? So a couple years ago at Music Mesa, um, I was at the Fishman booth and the caulk people were right across the way and I ended up using a uh, Twin Tone 3 amplifier, which is around here somewhere. And I really like the functionality of the, of the caulk amps. Dolph likes to use EL34s as his platform and builds the amp around there. So it's always a clean channel, clean channel with a boost, lead channel, with a gain boost and then another volume boost on top of that that you can set to your taste. And I love that, totally usable. Uh, nice reverb, the whole nine yards. So my only request was is that we do a combo. There are the lead channel that, or the clean channel that we could just must up a little bit more to get a little bit more grind if you want. I wanted a reverb that was a little bit more intense, preferably like the old tank reverbs that Fender made with the three controls you know, with the mix, the volume, and the tone. And then I'm a big fan of brown Fender era, with early 60s brown face Fender era amps that had harmonic vibrato on it, which is a tough thing to do. And they managed to hit the ball out of the park all across the board. And I wanted Sonic Blue Tolex. I like 10s, I like 210s, I like Vibraluxes. 210s, I like the tightness of it, but they made a custom cabinet for it that even bolsters up the low end frequency even more. So it's got the tightness and the directness of tens, but with a sinuous low end that sounds glorious. So we just mess around a little bit. This is the clean channel. You can also have it on uh, half power, which is 25 watt mode or 50 watt mode. I have it on the 50 watt mode right now because it's loud as hell in here. So I have the volume up about halfway. channel. I got the gain at like 12 o'clock. I got the volume of that particular channel at 12 o'clock. It's a squishier clean sound. It doesn't get spiky and bright. It just sounds squishy and delicious. I'm doing fucks. If I'm doing any of that Travis. All that stuff sounds killer, right? Um, if I want to add a little bit of har harmonic vibrato. take that off, here's the clean channel, I can add the OTS boost. OTS is out, stands for output tube saturation. So it's like adding a half watt power amp, tube power amp to your line level. So I just, I've got that set so I get a little bit more grind. So here's that clean channel. I'll add the OTS.
go back to this. Okay. Lead channel sounds like this. an overdrive on top of that, overdrive gain boost on top of that, so I got this. So here's the deal, if I go to the volume control on the guitar and turn it down. OTS on top of that, so I got overdrive channel with the gain boost on, I'll add the OTS on top of that, it sounds like this, it sounds like a fuzz. I just use the volume control on the guitar. To... And then, then back to Cleansville. of all time. Everything is on board. What are we charging for them in the States? Do we know? It needs to be discussed. It's going to be a hair under three grand though, right? Yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. They start shipping in March of 2018. We're going to have them at Wildwood. Really looking forward to getting them out there. The speakers on them are, are Jensen's. They're called Jensen Falcons. As I said before, EL34 tubes. Clean channel, clean channel with an OTS boost. Lead channel, lead channel with an OD boost and OTS on top of that. Beautiful tank, reverb, harmonic vibrato. I just dropped my pick. And it can either be harmonic vibrato or regular tremolo. So the amp is called, obviously by Cock, it is called the Greg. See what we did there? So there you have it. Thank you so much for tuning in, Greg Cock for Wildwood. We'll see you later.